Tonight, people in the Melrose community are turning to News 4 after they say dozens of cars were towed from their parking garage without warning. Yeah, so we're going to show you the area on a map here. It's the 2300 at Berry Hill Apartments. It's where we find News 4's Edward Birch. Edward, people there are not happy. They certainly are, Tracy and Lauren. These are actual residents who had their cars towed from this garage. The, they tell me that the complex cited parking pass violations as the reason why, but neighbors say that doesn't jive. Can I go to my car and it's not there? And when I finally run into a neighbor who says, are you looking for your car? And I said, yes. Um, and he said they have towed like 50 cars. He said they've been here since 11 o'clock last night. Rachel Smigelski says she was able to catch one of the tow trucks before they left the complex. And I kind of asked them, I said, you know, who authorized this? And they said that it was the leasing office at our apartment. She emailed me a copy of her leasing contract that says, quote, we may regulate the time, manner and place of parking cars and we may have unauthorized or illegally parked vehicles towed. Each resident's car has a pass key to get them inside the gate. Some cars have parking passes inside of them, but Rachel says it's never been enforced. My neighbor had said they had towed cars that even had the parking pass, so I'm still not completely sure on what the reason behind it is, but even if this was something that they wanted to start enforcing, you'd think that they would um, send out a notice. Smigelski says her bad morning only snowballed. I had to pay for an Uber out to Madison. That was about 50 bucks. And then I had to pay $200 to get my car back from the tow truck service. Um, and then I finally showed up to work about two, two and a half hours late. Now, management on site referred me to their corporate offices. I called the manager, the property manager here at corporate, and he simply said no comment, then hung up on me. Lauren and Tracy. Wow. Okay. That certainly isn't the answer you're looking for, Edward. Thank you.